What's going on, everybody? It's your man Chris here with another video for Bad Hombres TV. I have this weird obsession with people's talents. One of my favorite talents that I wish I had for myself was the ability to do impressions. I just think it's kind of cool that you, like people can change their voice and sound exactly like somebody else. So what I did, I put together a list of the best impressions and I want to be reacting to them and obviously showing you guys some of the best. I've seen some of this, some of this I haven't seen them. These are going to be pretty good. Oh, man. I almost had you. You almost had me? You never had me. You never had your car. <laughs> It doesn't matter whether you win by an inch or a mile. A win's a win. A win's a win. That was pretty good. I'm gonna give it a. Uh, I'm gonna give it a seven, seven out of ten. The mannerisms were good. the The tonality was good. It don't matter if you win by an inch or a mile. Winning's winning. But he actually even looks like him. So, seven out of ten in the scale of my uh, <laughs> my judgment on. Impressions. My oh, Jesus fucking Christ, Christopher, give me a fucking break, you camel nose prick. I practically lost my whole fucking crew. You didn't lose me, Tone, not by a long shot. You pinched my so called fucking camel nose and put me to permanent sleep after that accident. You were a fucking menace to yourself, Christopher, to your wife, to your daughter, and especially to fucking me. The Christopher Montesanti one is a little bit over the top. It's a little bit over the top. I mean, I know the guy is already over the top. I'm gonna give Tony a nine. And I'm gonna give Chris Montesanti a six. Did. Let's go talk to some animals. <laughs> hey, dog, how's it going? I like your fur. That looks really great. <laughs> so you're a dog, right? What's that all about? <laughs> Say hi to your mother for me, okay? <laughs> a lot of people want to eat you, but I just want to talk to you, okay? <laughs> we should do a film together. What do you think? Say hi to your mother for me, all right? <laughs> Say hi to your mother for me, okay? I'm in Max Payne. Have you seen that movie? Okay, donkey. Say hi to your mother for me. It was just like more like a parody than an impression. <laughs> Uh, it was funny, but I don't know if it was that good of an impression. In terms of being funny, I'll give it an eight. Yeah, if shit was at an eight, we like to make it ten. The actual impression, I'm gonna give it a six. <laughs> How dare you? Uh, when you uh, giving a speech, uh, make sure you use uh, a lot of pauses. Up, up, down, down. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. But like, again, you can always tell the difference. Listen, I want to give a 10 out of 10, but the one is like 10 out of 10 is because I'm if I close my eyes, I wouldn't be able to tell. And with this one, I'll be able to tell it's an impression. Oh, good for you. I give the Obama one a 7 out of 10. I'm feeling generous. Yeah. I'll give a 7 out of 10. Oh, my God. Wow. Imagine Obama spoke Spanish. Me llamo Obama. Eh, yo soy de Puerto Rico. Eh, let me be clear. Me gustan las mujeres de todos los países. Eh, arriba, abajo. Quería pueblo de los Estados Unidos. Hoy, por la economía, todos los negocios están cerrados. Thank you, Mark Wahlberg. Let's see. Marky Mark, what? Are you serious? I'm so confused. Where are we? WCIU, what does that stand for? What? <laughs> Okay, that one, that's what I mean. That was a 10 out of 10. That was a 10 out of 10. I am the one, the way your son don't need. Man, I wish I could, <laughs> I wish I could do uh, Mark Wahlberg. That, he's got such a cool voice, you know what I mean? Like, hey, where are we? <laughs> I can't do it. Say hi to your mother. <laughs> I can't do it. Stop it. Get some help. I mean, I'm about to do something special, though. You know, can I do, can I do that? Wow. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He pulls out the Toronto man's accent. Yo, man's are hungry out here, eh? <laughs> I hate, yo, one thing I hate is that fucking Toronto accent. I mean, can I, I mean, you know, everybody's, everybody's talking about me like, you know, like, <laughs> not, you know, yeah. Look, 
I got bitches. Yeah. I got bitches. I made a motherfucker. You know, it's a skill to to do impressions, but like to rap, just like the artist. That's that's. I, I gotta make a video on on singing impressions. I give it an eight out of ten. Denzel Washington thinking about running for president. All right, I thought about it, and I don't want to do it. It's too much work. <laughs> my man, I'd rather just seduce the ladies with my eyes and my lips. Huh? <laughs> Denzel was like, oh, that's pretty good. That's a good, uh, yeah, he does, he does well. He does, uh, does Will Smith well as well. He's, he's really good. The kid is good. How old is he? He's 22. What? He's 22. Get the hell out of here. My man. That's what he is. He's got to be the GOAT in that, in that space. That's for sure. That's for sure. Next, we have Frank Caliendo. President Bush. <laughs> I think it's great we have a president who seems like he's always looking directly into the sun. Man, this dude is old. It's an old video. Somebody do me a favor and hand me a pair of sunglasses. <laughs> Even the eyes and everything. That's that's, that's impressive. <laughs> Somebody get me a visor. <laughs> Sir, you mean advisor, no a visor. <laughs> what are you, stupid? <laughs> and he's the only person I've ever seen do this when he talks. <laughs> man part of doing the impression like even if the voice is at an eight but when you get the mannerisms down like that that just brings up the whole delivery of it like i gotta give this is a 10 out of 10 i mean i don't know i'll get i'll give this a 10 out of 10. <laughs> next we have craig gas first time i heard this guy was on howard stern another one and i heard him for his al pacino impression i thought I was like, wow, that was uh, that was mind blowing. I'm Al Pacino. I um, I got a question for you. Wow. I've been uh, taking in everything you got going on here. <laughs> hey, please, I implore you. Wow. Tell me what you think. I'm dying to know. <laughs> <laughs> he gets a. I, I lost track of my uh, my count, but he gets a ten out of ten. Up next, we have one of my favorite comedians of all time, Pablo Francisco. He's from Chile, but I don't think he, I don't even know if he speaks Spanish. But he's an OG. He's he's been around for a while. I met the movie previous guy in real life. He really talks like that. I met him. He was doing like a Brady Bunch commercial early morning radio. I walked in. He's like, "This summer has Brady written all over it." Hi, Pablo. Come on in here. <laughs> My name is Don. It's like, holy shit. Well, I wish I had the, the movie preview voice because then I'll, I'll just call restaurants or like, you know, for takeout and be like, can I get this sushi special? I'll be coming soon. This. <laughs> <laughs> just imagine making love to that guy every night. Oh, yeah. Ah. The passion <laughs> in your eyes burns with desire. Get it! <laughs> Get it over with. I gotta give this guy a a ten out of ten just because if if he gets hired to do a movie preview, um, he, he could get away with. It. Wait a minute, who are you? The Long Island Railroad is screwing up this job. It's a horrible job, on time and under budget. We're gonna go with Oliveria, or is it Oliveria? They're good people. They're Italian, but they're good. Why they punch you? I don't know. But they're Funny note here. I got to give a shout out to Donald Trump for uh, giving me the inspiration to start this channel like six years ago. But we have some bad hombres here and we're going to go. We're going to go with Oliveria. Or is it Oliveria? They're good people. They're Italian, but they're good. Why are they punch you? I don't know. But <laughs> Listen, if you close your eyes, that's 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 him. That's a 10 out of, that's a 10. Out of 10. Yeah, you, 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 bro, come on. That's a thing out of time. Bro. God is good. And yo, God is great. How done been do it all. Never know my fate. I'm going to come back now. And I'm going to show the world what I do. <laughs> Shamir and DMX talking to you. That's definitely a 10 out of 10. And I got to tell you something. We all know the movie on DMX is going to come out sooner and 
rather than later. Like it's, it, they should use this to, to some of the dubbing because that's a that's a solid impression. Seriously, what the fuck are you doing? Well, that's it for today, guys. I'm gonna try and find some more impressions. Uh, I got a couple ideas for more videos like this. But if you like it, please like and subscribe. And, and if you make impressions yourself, send them to me because I, I love impressions. I love watching that kind of stuff. I mean, that's that's my jam. You know what I mean? Anyway, I'll see you next time. So dark, can't see a thing. I hear some of the broken beat. Give me nickel, give me dime, give me doll, I'll give you a smile. Ah, oh, so dark, can't see a thing on the corner. Of